Today I will show you how to import orthophotos DTM or DSM in QGIS, how to convert to a national coordinate system, how to export them in the desired coordinate system, and as a bonus, how to check your data. I'm Stefan Niculescu, I have been a land surveyor for more than 20 years, and welcome to my channel Flying Surveyor, where I'm sharing my expertise and passion for surveying with a wider audience. If you're looking to download the uh, QGIS, you can find it on this website or just simple Google QGIS and uh, you can download it here. You have the Windows version, the Mac OS version, Linux and whatever. After you install it, uh, you open it and you will see something similar. We will choose a new empty project, double click, go to layer, add layer, add raster, layer now we need to choose uh, our orthophoto and the dsm file we go to orthophoto choose this add you can see it's on the screen we're gonna add also the dm or dsm and add you will see first the DSM because that's what was important last, but you can change just by drag and drop, simple as that. And now you can see the orthophoto first. To change the coordinate system, you go to this tab on the right bottom, uh, EAPSG. We click on it. As you can see, I already had it, but I'm going to do it from scratch and um, I live in the UK so I will look for OSGB we'll go here is Travis Mercator and the most common use the standard is 27700 we press apply and now we need a conversion and the one that is used for land surveying in the UK is this one number six and two meter accuracy you have all the details here press ok press ok again and uh, now you can see the the map is in 27700 which is OSGB the Great Britain coordinate system and um, if you want to check the accuracy of your conversion I have here a point you can click on it just go on DSM and I'll show you why because on DSM it shows you the elevation in here and if you press on the right derived you will see the coordinates uh, which is easting nothing and here the elevation you can compare this with your um, measurements and just make sure everything is okay we click on another one here dsm yep and derive now we need to export this as a projected grid national projected grid and how we're gonna do this you just right click on the layer uh, you press export save us uh, you need to create a um, file yep press render image that works better with some softwares uh, we need to select projected coordinate system so in my case is the ohgb 36 british national grid we untick this one because once it's saved it's gonna add it to your initial map so i will untick and okay same with the tsm if you found this video useful press the like button uh, subscribe for more videos like this and i will see you on the next one